Yeah. After a failed first attempt tonight, warrants have been signed for seven student athletes at Warren De La Salle High School. Five of those students are facing adult charges. The other two are going to be charged as juveniles in the hazing scandal that has engulfed the school now for months. Mara McDonald is at De La Salle tonight, where opinions on how this has been handled have been rather divided. I don't think that these charges today really are going to change anybody's attitudes here. You have deep divisions among the students and among the parents, and they question the credibility of the investigation. The pilots were headed to the playoffs last year until the president of the school, John Knight, canceled the entire season on Halloween, citing what he called a pervasive hazing problem year. From the start, parents, police, and coaches have said they're dissatisfied with how the school reacted. From the start, the administrators pulled kids apart uh, the, the initial day they put the seniors in the chapel, took their phones away from them, and, and kids get confused real, very quickly. We have an administration who does not have a plan and who hasn't had a plan on carrying us through any difficult times, let alone what our families are going through now. Police and prosecutors both said the school stood in their way when it came time to investigate allegations of hazing in the football locker room. Initially, uh, De La Salle, uh, uh, really didn't uh, cooperate uh, as they should have as far as the administration. So much so they announced there would be no charges here less than a month ago. Tonight that's all changed. Two new victims came forward and now police and prosecutors say there is enough evidence to charge seven student athletes with assault and battery. The boys allegedly using a broomstick in a threatening manner but no sexual assault. There was no penetration, but there was an assault, and that's why they're being charged with assault and battery. How deep are the divisions here? Just last week, there was an off-site meeting of more than 100 parents who turned out disgusted with the way the school has handled this. They want the president to be fired here. They are appealing to the Christian brothers, both here in the United States and in Rome, to make that happen. We are in Warren. I'm Mara McDonald, Local 4.